Line of Symmetry Try folding the rectangle as shown. The two parts are not exactly equal. Now try folding it as shown. The imaginary line divides the given rectangle into two exactly equal parts. This line is called the line of symmetry. Each symmetrical figure can have one or more lines of symmetry. Asymmetrical figures do not have a line of symmetry. Tessellation A tessellation of a flat surface is covering of a plane using one or more geometric shapes. A tessellation is created when a shape is repeated over and over again, covering a plane without any gaps or overlaps. Another word for tessellation is tiling. When you fit individual tiles together with no gaps or overlaps to fill a flat space, such as a ceiling, wall or floor, you get a tiling. A regular tessellation is a pattern made by repeating a particular shape. Non-tessellating figures Figures that have gaps in between or that overlap when repeated are called non-tessellating figures. Neha and Mona made a few shapes with colored papers. They arranged them in a pattern. What shape will come next? The shapes are arranged in a particular order. When the order repeats itself, we call it a pattern. Number Patterns Patterns can be made using numbers as well. Look at the following number patterns. 5, 7, 9, 11, 13 and so on. 6, 8, 10, 12, 14 and so on. What comes next? In both the patterns we add 2 to get the next number. The next number in each pattern will be greater than the previous number. Such patterns are called increasing number patterns. Let us see another pattern. 13, 10, 7, 4 and so on. This is a decreasing number pattern. This pattern is continued by subtracting 3 from the last number each time.